So this is a video for people that want to do YouTube. First, let me just tell you the basic advice first that you already heard a million times. And you'll always hear it if you watch another how to be a YouTuber video on YouTube. Number one is consistency. That's it. If you don't have that, you will fail. Now, let's move on from that. Let's go to the main problem, which is overthinking stupid little shit. Three things. The niche, thumbnail, the video idea and the profile picture whatever whenever you have these thoughts whenever the whenever you think too much on these areas please be quiet and just make the video whatever idea comes to your head in the moment just quickly write a script down on your notepad on your notes on like iphone notes voice memo whatever do that and then take the action whenever you have time now all of these advices great advices have already been said before because i watched a lot of people like gary v like other motivational stuff they already said it. Now, the only value out of this video is my own personal experience and what I learned, which I will talk about now. Now, if you look at my channel right now, it says I have like 200 to 250 videos. I did not check. I honestly don't know. That is false. I have made over 400 videos and I started in 2019. Here's a screenshot. So I have 200 videos uploaded, but I have 400 videos uploaded and I privated the other 200, half of the videos I privated due to stupid reasons. And that reason is the fear of other people I personally know my discovering my videos it's a stupid thing i know it's dumb but yeah i did it the main point is i still created videos it took me around five years to get my first 100 subscribers so i started 2019 20 20 20 21 yeah four or five years to get 100 subscribers i remember i would sometimes look at reddit how long did it take you to reach your 100 subscribers i would search that on google and go on reddit almost everyone in the comments said yeah i reached 100 subscribers in three months i reached 100 subscribers in six months i reached 100 subscribers in in a month i was shocked and the only thing i could think of was does my content suck really bad well yes but here's the thing the harder you work on a video and if it takes really really long you put in the hard work and you felt proud of it took like days and weeks and the moment when you finish it and upload it you feel good that's a great feeling that has a high chance to get views and reach people and i'm not gonna lie my content is like pretty simple not too much editing i do here and then sometimes i pay other people to edit my videos but most of the times it's just uh, a gameplay video and there's me talking over it making sure i edit who who can't do that and that i deserve like to wait a lot longer if i like edited put more effort in the editing or buying editors i probably would have grown faster so i have this video called if you're lonely you'll never be successful in music that is doing well so far i'm still getting notifications to, to from it time to time i actually don't know the view count i'm not i'm not even lying i made another video called hamza made me see the light or penguins made me see the light and like here are the screenshots when I uploaded these videos, I was getting notifications from it. And I know these videos were doing well. And here's one other thing. I told you I don't know the views. I actually don't. Whenever I go on YouTube, log in, and upload my video, I would drag my window to the right side of the screen where I could hide the numbers. I don't even look at the numbers. They're evil to me. Let's just be honest. If you see your numbers doing low or high, it will impact your mood greatly. And I don't want to like have that on me no one cares about your feelings just show up to work create the videos you're genuinely interested in and deliver it to the boss and by that i mean upload it to mr youtube and then move on with your life until the next video idea comes to your head one other thing i do is like whenever i'm on youtube sometimes it'll show which account do you want to log in and it'll show the number of subscribers right away and then when you press upload it'll make you t it'll take you to your manage video section this is where i drag the windows to the right and this is sometimes where i close one eye and use my left eye because my left eye eyesight is so bad i barely can see from close and so like i know i can see a little bit i know where i'm going when uploading video that's what i do i just don't look at the numbers i just create videos and upload that's literally it time to time i do check the numbers sometimes by an accident and sometimes i'm genuinely curious last time i checked was two weeks ago so yeah that's all i can say i have nothing else to add so get your brain's thoughts into action peace out